can only stay four days. Well, I'm upset. I'll make the most of it. How long did you pack my travel, Jim? Yes. Oh, your father bought an exercise device on television. He does it every morning at four. Only 25 minutes a day. And you can attach it to any doorknob. So uh, I guess your travel miles are about to expire. Well, actually, Jerry, we wanted to talk to you about something. Am I finally getting a baby brother? <laughs> Jerry, be serious. How would you feel if we sold the Cadillac? What? The, the Cadillac I bought for you? It's so much car, Jerry. Oh, come on, you love that car. What about the boot store system? I don't think we even use it. <laughs> well, it's a gift, and I want you to keep it. We already sold it. <laughs> well, why, why didn't you tell me before you sold it? Because we had a buy, and we couldn't get a free flight and talk now. Well, we could, but we wanted the boat hit. Oh. He's wearing me out. Kramer. Oh, no, it's not the sex, Jerry. Well, hey, it's our <laughs> Hi, Kramer. We're in the middle of a discussion here. Uh, Jerry's upset. We sold a Cadillac. Look, what'd you get for it? Jack Clappers gave us six grand. You sold my Cadillac to Jack Clappers? I want you to have the money. I don't need the money. What are you talking about? You had a check bounce in the bodega. Oh, is that what this is all about? I bounced a check and you sold a Cadillac? Well, also, Jerry, we read an article in the Sun Sentinel. It says that stand-up comedy is not what it used to be, but with Def Jam at all. Now, that Def Jam is a force. Jerry, you know, I like hear wonderful things about Bloomingdale's executive training program. Oh. Well, you're giving this comedy thing your best shot. Some good observations, but it's over. And this Bloomingdale thing could be the next wave. <laughs> If you're living with moderate to severe plaque psoriasis or active psoriatic arthritis, symptoms can sometimes hold you back. But now there's Sky Rizzi. 